was 10 years old when she died, and she's over there. Marion Booth and her family have been searching for the burial site of her grandmother for more than a year now. When the community got word of her search, they decided to lend a helping hand and paw. More than 20 members of Gulf Coast Search and Rescue brought out their cadaver dogs to help sniff out the cemetery. Property owner Ed Bird, who claims to have seen the site in 2004, was also present. If you go straight down to the right, does this hill pitches off? The cemetery is right there to the right. The total group of about 30 split off with high spirits and positive attitudes. I do believe that it's going to work today. We're going to find it. Sight it. The dogs, who are trained to locate human remains, led the way. We're just looking for like differences in terrain, like where holes may have been dug years ago and stuff falling in them. It's going to be softer in that area than probably the next area. Trudging and hacking through acres of wet, overgrown forest was trying, and conflicting memories from different people pulled the groups in different directions. And the cemetery would be this direction. We're going to have to take it off. Yeah, we're going to have to it off. <laughs> After two hours of searching, the dogs were tiring, and the group began to make plans for continuing the search on another day. But then... I'm on my way! He's in the thicket. I knew it was in these thickets. Deep in the thickets, far off any trails, they found it. And it was more than the family ever imagined. It's all good. I know it's it. all good. It's all good. It's all good. Just take oh, deep breath. God, I've been looking for this so long. Oh. Hello? Mom? What, darling? We have it. No, you Yes, we do. <laughs> Listen to them. <laughs> Yes. yes! And just a few steps in... Zelfie's grave is right in front of me. Oh, Zelfie Newkirk. Zelfie Newkirk? Yes. That's my granddaughter. Yes, I know. In total, the group found around six headstones belonging to several members of Marion's family. Now, Father, we want to thank you for letting us find uh, your home of grace burial here. Father, I want to thank you for everybody that came out to help today. This is what you call neighborhood togetherness. Togetherness that brought a family back together and finally laid to rest a year-long search.